Uh, hello, Genitive AI and uh, coding agents uh, impacted a lot on software development, especially for small businesses, small studios and indie developers, because mostly they worked with some small apps and implement approach when they created MVPs, minimal value products, when they launch application with only one feature, uh, get the fast response from uh, the real users, get these serial users immediately and may change the application approach and business logic for the application uh, so this approach worked for previous years and beginning from this year this approach is not working anymore because the rejection of the uh, application in case of design spam is growing rapidly in this year and we may check uh, my case when I have only one account and only one application was well, currently under review. It's submitted but not yet released in uh, App Store. As you can see, it just have some uh, warning message. And this application has only one uh, release build in uh, better version and still uh, rejected by 4.3.0 design spam and if you are checking this point in uh, apple guidelines and in the point a it say uh, don't create multiple bundle ids of the same app if your app has different versions for specific locations sportings universities etc consider submitting a single app and provide the variations using in-app purchase and in point b also avoid peeling on to a categories what already saturated. The App Store has enough fat and etc. Applications already will reject these apps unless they provide a unique high quality experience. Spamming the store may lead to your removal from the Apple developer program. For my first app, I focus mostly on application what it will come to not saturated category and basically for fermentation calculation we don't have a lot of applications in the app store so it's not a saturated category definitely not saturated it's a very niche category and uh, basically i don't have any other application in my portfolio so it's sim single application so it's kind of be a spam with different application for the same user and it can be in a very saturated category what is coming to point B and if you are checking message from app review it shows us what uh, we notice your shares a similar binary metadata and or concept as app submitted to the app store by other developers with only minor differences submitting similar or replaced apps in the is a form of spam will create clutter and make it difficult to users to discover new apps. I use the same approach what is used by other uh, indie developers. I just created a very simple app with only one or two screens and try to submit it to the app store and check how it's working. So test this application and it was rejected. So why it's mentioned in the beginning what genes uh, of AI and agents impacted a lot on software development. Basically what uh, these uh, agents create very similar code when you request some simple apps. So when it's coming to Apple uh, review, uh, then I guess uh, some artificial intelligence analyze the code, metadata and binary about the, some difference between uh, uh, already submitted apps or apps what already um, located in uh, uh, review process and when it's coming to application that is getting by or created by these uh, agents they i guess they are very similar by binary code and uh, this application rejected automatically by apple review in this year it's not enough to have some idea and create a very simple app mvp and distribute it to app store and get some feedback from them 
current uh, approach what we have now and how to avoid this rejection by design spam we need to create a real product not just uh, build some feature of your idea but a real product with different features with different experience and uh, with high quality not the low one when you just put some prompt for your agent and get some application from this but create a real high quality app and most probably then you pass through this uh, review process and don't try to push once again your application with some minor changes to allow what it might be will not be rejected uh, because mostly you will be banned from uh, app store and your account will be removed from uh, apple developer program so don't think what it's uh, just some mistake of the system and you need just to submit once again your build and if you, everything will be passed so with my first application what i created and tried to get this application on app store and it was rejected on the first step it's a little bit sad for me but still yeah i will try to, to refactor my application uh, and uh, i guess add some new features and i hope so it will be approved because the more features you add to your application and your product the more this application will be different from other applications uh, then the more your binary and metadata will not be the same as some application already submitted to the app store so our software development approach was changed by artificial intelligence and apple changed the approach how to uh, review and uh, filter application app store so we need just more focus on our application not just submit everything what we want but create a real high quality applications with more and more user experience and then you have your application on app store so don't focus on fast release more on app quality